Welcome back to Studio 10. Tomorrow on Perspectives, Eric Reynolds sits down with Sandy Stimson, Mobile's third term mayor, to learn more about his plan for the first 100 days in office. Eric, good to see you as always. Always. So this is an incredibly important topic. A lot of folks in our area want to know what is the plan for the city? What's going to happen next? What are the areas of focus that we're looking into? And you had a chance to look into all that. Yeah, Mayor Stimson is really excited about this third term. In fact, uh, he set what some are calling, even himself, an ambitious plan mm -hmm. for these first 100 days. And he's geared toward looking at seven major focus areas to sort of both uh, begin some projects and finish some that got waylaid during this last year and a half. So uh, we don't have time to probably go through all seven <laughs> no, here. No. You will see that tomorrow on Perspectives. But what are some of the things that you're taking a look at? Well, I think some of the ones that uh, stand out are looking at the growth of the city. And of course, annexation comes up in that conversation. Mm -hmm. Public safety, he says we are committed to that. And his you know initial slogans coming out back in uh, eight years ago mm -hmm. about this being the friendliest and safest city in America. And so some new uh, areas of I guess you could say reflecting on how do we do this better because as you know this year has been tough in the numbers of homicides and shootings and so uh, he brings in the aspect of the community it's all about everyone working together if we come to a scene of an incident and no one can talk to us or tell us anything then you know that, that not, that's not going to work you know yeah. it's not going to get uh, things resolved and so uh, we talk about that he talks about infrastructure the money that has come down from the federal government and the build back better plan and the different uh, things that happened during the uh, COVID response he addresses those areas so uh, tourism of course yeah. the cruise ship coming back so I mean he's he's got it laid out for every area including uh, for the youth and parks and recreation, which we also heard from the state of the city, state of the county address. Sure, all important topics. I know a lot of people have wanted to know what the situation is with some of the downtown renovation. You know, we just did Mardi Gras Park. They're talking about the Civic Center plan that was talked about for a while, and then some of the downtown streets being redone. So do you touch mm -hmm. on that too a little bit? We don't get a chance to go into as much of that yeah. as we love to, but that falls under the infrastructure. Right. And he talks about some of the projects that are going on right now, in fact, uh, Airport Boulevard being a main one. I, <laughs> I have to address that every morning, you know. Sure. But um, he looks at some of those areas. Uh, we didn't get a chance to go into the Civic Center, but in his 100 uh, days plan of attack, uh, that's an area you can go to through our uh, website and see all those things and see what you might want to be a part of because he wants citizen involvement in this plan. All right, so definitely want to tune in for this conversation. So much to learn, so much to gather from it. When can they do so, Eric? And good news, we're back at 9 a.m. now, starting tomorrow morning. Uh, football season over on Fox as far as that uh, pushing us back. We'll be on at 9 right after Gianni and Matt Barron time finish up the news. And, of course, uh, if you miss it, please join us on our YouTube channel, Fox 10 uh, YouTube, as well as our website, which uh, you'll get the information. And the mayor, he shares some good stuff. Yeah, definitely want to hear what is going on. Want to know what the plan is moving forward. The new time, 9 o'clock. Back to 9 o'clock tomorrow. To nine, yeah. So don't miss that. Eric, thanks so much. <laughs> Thank you, Joe. All right, Chelsea.